Get your flu shot by Halloween. That is the message today from the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. The latest numbers are in. The CDC reveals just how widespread the flu was last season and what the upcoming season may look like. Beth Ward is here with what you need to know. And Beth, I understand the CDC says parents are doing a record job in getting their kids vaccinated. Yeah, we are as parents. Good at for least. us. Yes, <laughs> as far as last year goes, we'll see this year. That's the good news, Jordan. The bad news is last season, less than half of us adults got their shots. So the CDC is launching a new campaign to make sure more Americans get their flu shot. Along with costumes and carving pumpkins, the CDC wants everyone to get their flu shot by Halloween. Today, the agency officially kicks off its 2019-2020 flu vaccination campaign, saying this year's vaccines have been updated to be a better match for the particular influenza viruses circulating in other parts of the world, generally an indicator of what we'll see here. Looking at what's happening in Australia, this has potential to be another severe season for the flu. The numbers are in from last season and here's how the CDC says it stacks up. Two years ago was the most severe in a decade for the flu. Last year was ranked moderate but broke records for duration, 21 weeks and doses distributed 169 million. Last year less than half of adults got the vaccine 45 percent but a record 63 percent of children six months to 17 years old got the shot. And what happened as well last year is the number of pediatric deaths dramatically declined. Some of that is the type of influenza, but again, some of it is vaccinating these kids prevents death and severe mortality. Pediatrician Dr. John O'Reilly at Bay State Medical Center tells Western Mass News also knew this year an improved nasal mist option for children. A couple years ago, we were finding that the nasal vaccine was really no more effective than placebo. And now they've changed it. They've gotten more of the antigens and more protection into that so that now when the kids get it in their nose, their immune system can recognize the flu and be prepared to fight it off. The CDC urging everyone six months and older to get their shot. There should be plenty to go around. They project 169 million doses will be rolled out all across the U.S. Well, here in Massachusetts, Dr. O'Reilly says word from the State Department of Public Health is that if they don't already, all doctor's offices should have the flu vaccine by tomorrow, Friday or Monday. In the studio, Beth Ward, Western Mass News.